This video is brought to you by Mixter Headphones. For more information on the new Ghost and Rentu headphones, click in the annotation for a short review, as well as a chance to win one of three Rentu headphones that they are giving away in partnership with us. Thank you. Hey everybody, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to customize your home screen by adding home screen widgets that we use over here at HowToMan. Throughout many of our videos, people have asked what widgets we use and how we set them up ourselves. So today we're going to be taking a look at the past three widgets I've used. So for this video, I have set up all three widgets on three different screens and we'll be showing you guys what apps and packs they came from and the changes I've added. So first things first, for all these widgets, you're going to need Zooper widget and I have the pro version, which may be required for some of these widgets. I'm actually unsure. So let's take a look at the first widget, which is the one I currently have set up on my home screen. Now this is really simple. All you need is the app Marshlow Zooper widget, and you need to select the widget called MZO underscore climate. I haven't done anything to change this one because I like the color scheme and all of the current settings. However, for the widget to work completely, you're going to need bitmap icon set for the weather icons. And if you need to change anything, you can go into the Zooper settings and change things such as the color, text, as well as the font. So let's move on to our second widget. For this widget, once again, you use Zooper widget, and the widget pack it comes from is called Asus or Asus Zooper Skin. The widget name is Shape 10, and once you have it selected, you can go into the widget settings and change things such as the size, the colors, and the fonts. As you can see on mine, I have changed the colors, and I have changed the color of the center circle so it is a bit more transparent than it is on the default one. I have added, the, added another text item that displays the battery percentage. And if you need any additional help on how to set this up, or if you're wondering about my settings, I'm going to see if I can post them in the comments or add a Google Drive document linked to the description. Anyways, let's get on to our third and final widget. Our final widget comes from the pack Alpha Zooper, which can be found on the Play Store. It is widget 109, however, if you, as you can see, I've changed the colors and spaced out the numbers a bit more. I have also adjusted the size of the widget to fit in my screen. This part may not be necessary for everyone. It really depends on how large you set the original Zooper widget. All right, guys, so these are the last three widgets that I have used on my home screen, and many people have been asking about them. So don't forget to check them out, and the Play Store links are going to be in the description. Don't forget to check us out on social media and subscribe for more content. Until the next time, guys, stay fresh.